Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. Uh, we got another leak here, uh, Skellige this time. Really excited to see how they um, went with for the final pieces of the Price of Power puzzle. Uh, I, I've really been enjoying playing Skellige, I'm not going to lie. Uh, starting on a new account. Um, it's been a lot of fun. Um, I'll have a pull up next... Uh, Next free to play video, which will be tomorrow, on which faction you want me to try next. Um, after I hit that one to pro rank, I'm going to try to get it to pro rank, but I don't think it'll happen this season. But we'll see. Um, but uh, the new card, let's check it out together. Um, it's a six for four, little Hoffrey. Hoffrey? Did I get it right? Probably not. Uh, it's a beast. Deploy bonded. Increase this card's base power by two. Order, damage self by four, and spawn rain for two turns on an enemy row. So, if you play this with Mushy Truffle, let's say, you get a one that could possibly spawn rain for two turns. And then this one's going to be a, an eight. And then it damages itself by four, and you can spawn rain for two turns. Or you could just leave it go. Um, you're probably going to want to spend it. And uh, I think this card pairs up really nice with the uh, the singer. It, uh, I mean, because if you could start healing this up for a couple turns, it uh, it's going to spawn that extra two for the siren, and uh, you know the rain and stuff. So you get heal synergy, you get rain damage synergy. And then, you know, you're probably going to be playing great swords with this list. Not sure if you go all in on the the rain list. But, I mean, you're going to play Brides of the Sea for stuff like this. The Fulmar on this could be bananas if you could somehow get it to pop off. Fulmar just never seems to live, though. Like, he always gets removed. His, his ability is just crazy, though. If, like, if you can get this to pop off for... You know, Skellige Storm for like six turns on a big row. Wow. Um, it's uh, it it definitely seems like it's it's you know it's it's just base strength. I mean, you play this bonded and it's an eight. It flat out it's a six. That uh, it would if you played it on its own, it's a six. You spawn rain for two turns. It drops down to a two. But then you got to be hitting two units that are going to be worth it. I think this is going to pair up with that mushy truffle if, if you're going to play it. I think, though, the mushy truffle, you're going for, like, the druid synergy with Gedneath. Um, I hope they change Gedneath. Um, it just, the only thing they need to change is this dumb crow, uh, crow's eye. It's, it's just... It takes up too much board space, and the, the crows don't do anything for you. Like, they do nothing for you. Like, it needs to spawn another unit, or... I, I would love to see it spawn one of those singers. Or even more, or even better, like a priest. Like, that would be fantastic if it gave you a priest. Because this doesn't do anything for you but eat up board space. Especially in, like, a Nilfgaard, you know, game, where you're strapped for board space. And these crows just, you you got two-point bodies on the board, and they're just constantly putting spies on your side of the board. This this does nothing for you if you're Skellige. Like, nothing. They need to uh, change this. And and I think Gedneath would be really, really great. Uh, especially with the truffle and spawning possibly three preachers. A turn. Procking. I mean, I guess then you get the the value off of this, but it's like... It just eats up so much space. Like, give them something different. Even a Freya. Like, this is junk. Like, get rid of this. Just get rid of this and this card will be great. Um, but yeah, I, I like this card. Um, I love the art. It seems like it's... Uh, I don't know. Skellig is funny because it's like... You know, you've seen Spiro playing, you know... The Melusine list and stuff. And... 
he did good with it. He did really. I think he got it up to twenty six hundred, but I don't know. I, I'd like to see more from from this, and I think they have it. It's just it's 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 set up. You know what I mean? It's I don't know. I'll give it a try for sure. Um, I love the art. Absolutely love it. Um, but uh, also too, let's check out the Skellige or Syndicate card from yesterday. Uh, it's a four for four. The Savvy Huckster. It's just a human, so you don't get any type of Ziggy tags on it. You know, there's no. I I, I think this card needs some kind of tag to it. Um, but it's profit one, so it's it's a four for five, and then it damages a unit by one, so it's a six for five. Possibly sometimes too that one profit get is is good to get the boat out. You know what I mean? Like you're at eight and you don't want to over profit and you don't have a spender. Uh, and then bonded the second one, it's going to play for four for four with two profit and two damage. So I could possibly play for an eight, maybe more, depending on the spender you're hitting with the coins. I think it's kind of slow, but I, I if it had tags to it, like you get no value off of this. I just think there's better spenders, like you know, at four P, you want to be playing, you know, your sea urchins or. You know, sea jackals, you know what I mean? Something that's a spender, and then you want to be filling your deck up with these smuggles and swindles and bloody good funds and dips. Sphistex. Like, the four-piece slot for Syndicate, you don't want all this, like, little stuff. Like, they got such... They're so top-heavy with their, you know, witch finders and professors and Siggy and Philippa. Like, you want this stuff in your deck like this is where you win the game like this shit down here like like Skellige you can win your games with some bronze cards like their bronze cards are shit like other than the bloody good friends and you know some of the other ones it's like you know the coerced blacksmiths like those are the cards that you want like this yeah it's instant value but like you want spenders you want other things like this is just too weak I think I don't think it sees plays at all I mean you could get a big you know Igor meme probably going with it but it doesn't really seem worth it um, that's the video for today guys just a bonus one to go over the cards um, another one will be up tomorrow uh, depending on what well I'll, I'll do the other um, Skellige card I think that's going to be the legendary I might do that today we'll see um, but Thank you guys so much for everything. Cheers. Thanks for watching and enjoying the uh, free-to-play as much as I am. And it's uh, it's been a lot of fun. I'm going to try to get that up to uh, Pro Rank um, after I do that. Pick another faction. I'll let you guys pick it. Of course, it's going to be no card though, right? I'll see you guys next time.